Too old. With seven? The seven who? Seven what? The seven where? The seven how? Oh yeah, it's seven. We interrupt this global pandemic to bring you a public information broadcast on behalf of, well, the planet. Politics without principle. A form of passive violence. A gateway to war, with no guns or swords. Such weapons are not necessary to destroy a community. Only the words or actions of a powerful being whom deserves no such title. Do you want a children's fire to represent the voices of the next seven generations? For health and safety getting in your way, get the upgraded paper totem that represents the children's fire. It's so simple, even a world leader can do it. the ancient traditions of indigenous peoples of America, they have always considered the seventh generation. Not our children's generation, not our grandchildren's generation, not even our great-grandchildren's, but the generation of our great, great, great-grandchildren. It was the voice of this generation that was considered. They would light a children's fire at the centre of all their important meetings. And as they made vital decisions about their lives, their community's livelihoods and the future of their people. Not as theirs now, but the world in seven generations' time. And how the decisions made today would affect the lives of those tomorrow. What do you think about keeping this to We should. And Nick, you should do it. And Nick, what do you think? The Children's Fight is a pledge to the welfare of unborn future children, human and non human alike. It's a pledge to life, a commitment to responsibility, a plea, a prayer, a song of ancient wisdom now forgotten.
voices of the seventh generation, and we want our tale to be told.